Hi everyone, we are really looking forward to welcoming you back for your school swimming lessons at Weatherby Leisure Centre. If you have been to the centre before, you may notice it looks a little different with multiple spots on the doors, floors and walls. These are here to ensure our staff and customers stay safe. Please do excuse if the building works aren't quite finished in the centre, hopefully they will be shortly. Now before you leave school, please ensure those noses are blown as we do not want any caterpillars in the water. Please remember to wash those hands. Teachers, remember your face masks as these must be worn in all circulation areas. Remember your woggles and armbands if you know you need them. Woggles will be provided on your first lesson, then please remember to bring them each week. Let's take a look at where you'll be entering the facility when you arrive. Your entrance is via the main front doors. Please ask your driver to drop you on the left hand side at the end of the building. Line up on the path ready to walk up to the centre. There may be other customers waiting to go into the centre, however they will remain socially distanced on their allocated spots. A member of staff will invite you into the centre five minutes before the start of your lesson. Before you enter, adults must have on face coverings. Please make sure you enter the building in a safe and calm manner and hand sanitise on your way in if needed. Instead of the teacher signing in, a representative from the school will inform the member of reception staff how many swimmers you have brought and the name of a staff member. The receptionist will allocate your changing rooms on arrival, either male or female, and all children will go together. Please collect your shoe covers from the stand. Here, we have been allocated the male changing rooms, so we will head through the door on the right. To speed up your changing, if you could all arrive beach ready with costumes and shorts underneath your top layers, this would be really helpful. In the changing area, please remove your shoes, coats and top layers, and you can leave everything in the changing rooms at Weatherby. Teachers put on those shoe covers before going on to poolside. Make your way through the changing rooms to the pool, however you may be asked to wait at this point if the poolside isn't quite clear. Once the centre staff are ready, you will then make your way to your lesson station. When in swimming lessons, it is important that you listen to your teacher at all times. They really need your help right now and there is to be no shouting. If you have long hair, this needs to be tied up or a swimming hat worn. Swimming kit needs to be either a one piece costume or shorts that do not go past your knees. And when moving around poolside and the change rooms, you must not run as the floor will be wet, which makes it very slippery. Please do be careful. There are two types of alarms that you may hear when you are in a leisure centre. It is important that you know what to do when you hear each one. The first one is the drowning alarm and it sounds like this. is sounded if someone needs help in the pool or has any medical problems. When you hear this, your swimming teacher will ask you to leave the pool in a safe and quick manner. You will then be taken to your changing rooms. The second alarm is a fire alarm and sounds like this. This alarm is sounded if there is a fire in the building. When this alarm sounds, you will be asked to leave the pool as quickly and safely as possible. You will then line up at the nearest fire exit with your swimming teacher. If you need the toilet during your lesson, please let your swimming teacher know and a school teacher will direct you to the toilets. Please make sure you wash your hands thoroughly to keep the pool water clean. To finish your lesson, please ensure your woggles and armbands are cleaned. Place them in your kit bags. Teachers, please do remember to take your woggle bag back with you to school. You will then need to make your way back to the same changing rooms you used at the start. As we were allocated to the boys, we will use the changing rooms to the left hand side. It is going to be rapid, so please quickly get dry, clothes on, shoes on, and out of the door, please. You do not need to leave any belongings behind. Teachers, ensure those masks are on before exiting the changing rooms. You will exit the changing rooms by the usual doors. You may be asked to be held at this point if there are customers coming through. Please walk on the right as you walk out of the building. You will exit the building using the front doors as normal, and walk down the stairs where your bus will be waiting in the same place as you were dropped off. We're looking forward to having schools at Weatherby Leisure Centre again. Enjoy yourselves and remember, wash or sanitise your hands when needed.